folks. Um, where's Fred? There's Fred. Hi, Fred. Hi, Jeffy. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for letting me read in your show. <laughs> um, uh, I guess. Um, I feel like a lot of affinity with this work and particularly like going through the files there was there was a lot that spoke to me but like one of the things that kind of <coughs> has leapt out to me recently and I feel is kind of a lost art form is um, the art form of the personal ad so I used to be like I was I was um, I was an addict to, to the to like the misconnections ads in the talk in the voice, right? Like thinking like somebody would say something about like something that happened to them on the train and it would be they were talking about me. And, um, but also the way like in in um, in queer publications you had to come up with. Um, in the absence of a photograph, you had to come up with like a self-description and a sort of, and so I'm I, I sort of went back into that form, and so the thing I'm going to read is a is um, is a version of a personal ad, um, but also the thing that has that moves me so much about the work is the way that it it feels very true to my experience of my body as this kind of like collection of oddities <laughs> and sort of the, the ground where all of these different things intersect, stories and images of myself and things like that. So, um, so this, is, this is kind of the, the monstrous personal ad, okay? Um, so, um, Shambling monstrosity seeks mad science. Um, me, six foot, two inch, 285 pound, grizz, bear, bottomed, molatus to mutt thing, with newly trained plot, occasional ingrown hairs, and many that are outgrown as well. <laughs> Smoker, happily forgetful, drinker, and tiny pocket packer on intoxicants, pretty Corny, popped, post palatable, depressed, wearing thin and wearing finery, an aspiring preacher without a flocking, who would build a cavern of wonders to rival Ludwig if they didn't shit where they ate. <laughs> I learned everything I know worth knowing from fist feminists, and now I am a gender neutral bathroom. Preferred pronouns are grumble, lubricate, and omnivore. Trained by year on year of after school cartoons, moving drawings where everything became everything else, anvils falling to boys and girlfriends named Goo with no block to their heads, hosted by ranchers or at least men in rooms with bales of hay who hold their dummies on their laps and play the straight men to chunks of wood, while in ice cream castles adorned with neon boos, rabbits dispense manicures of bold mouse traps, and children clap with anxiety. I have learned that there are no wrong holes and arrange my expansive and deeply recolonized terrain accordingly. Looking for researchers wielding electricity and assistance with a taste for grave robbing and fly gobbling because of all the little lives therein, who leap before they lock and nestle their pestle. You may be single, double, or legion, just be ready to cast me out. You can have your own fungin or say hi to me, my placards are yours. We will, we will flee and forgive the tiresome town folk together until they reach the rutted ruins of this country's comfortless dream nooks when we will turn and tentacles entwined beg them to present their pitchforks and torches which we will mount until they are extinguished and blunted or the patriarchy ends, whichever comes first. Serious replies only. <laughs> I am a fat femme phony, you be the same. Don't waste my time or your own. 